Well, thanks for your interest in Mobi One Studio. Today we're going to look at the Mobi One Design Center, which is what will come up by default the first time you open Mobi One after download. Uh, so you'll be greeted with uh, this component library, which has over 60, uh, 60 items in it. Uh, first, you'll see kind of some familiar buttons and images and forms like toggles, checkboxes, radios, uh, drop downs, things that you're used to seeing in iPhone applications, text areas, various kinds of tables, and then customizable things like uh, various kinds of boxes and images that you might use for your own branding. You're also going to see here on the media palette uh, various kind of navigation bar buttons. Uh, these are typically going to be in the footer, but they can be wherever you want in your application. You'll see like play buttons, paper clips, trash, some of those kind of things that you might be used to seeing on your iPhone. And finally, there's an outline view. Once you get going, uh, you can take a peek at the outline view and uh, see really what's, uh, what kind of layers you're using in your application, uh, similar to the way you'd look at layers in a Photoshop or a PowerPoint. So let's come to the component. Uh, we're going to create something really simple to start. Um, so I'm just going to create a group, and that's going to drop and format those for me. I'm also going to create a navigation bar um, up top. And we're just going to call this example. And we don't really need either of these buttons, so we can delete these. Just a simple right click, and same on the back button. And we're just going to call this example app. One label is going to be whatever we want it to be. This is going to be called stuff. This is going to be called things. And in the footer, we're going to put example things. Obviously, we could name these whatever we wanted. This is just an example. So I'm going to go into my media. And in my example app, maybe I want to go be able to go to the next page. Um, you'll see that this is going to highlight a nice drop area for me. So I'm going to put that there. And I'm going to put another one on our things label. Okay, so all I've done really right now is just created a super simple application um, that doesn't really do much yet. It's not linked to any databases or anything like that. But let's say this has the look and feel that I want. Um, if I want to add company branding, I can come to the image, drag and drop some branding into there, whatever I want to do. But let's just say this is done for the moment. And what we're going to do is quickly see how that's going to actually run if it were on an actual iPhone. See this green button here is to run it in the Test Center emulator, which comes with Mobi One as well. And this is a true behavior emulator. It's going to ask me if I want to save that, because obviously the test center has to have something to reference. So I'm going to go ahead and save that just as, I've got another one here called test, I'll just save it and overwrite that. Yeah, I'll replace it. So that's going to save that, and then that's going to open up the test center for me. So again, I'm going to be able to see how this app, little application that I have is actually going to be able to behave on a real iPhone. Um, this is not just a skin that's over it. Uh, by activating the test center, we've actually generated all the code that's necessary, um, all the HTML5, CSS, JavaScript, everything that you could want for your web application is now in the test center. So let me drag that into here so you can see it a little bit better. Okay, so you can see our application here um, doesn't have much to it still. It's not going to really respond because I haven't told these buttons to go anywhere. This is just for our own purposes. So I'm going to open this up and you can see exactly what it is that the test center is reading. So we can go into our tools and we can just kind of see exactly what's going on. We can see our source code here. Um, so if you're someone that can actually get into the source code and tweak things, we can see all of our resources. See, you see it, HTML, CSS, JavaScript it generated. So we can go in and tweak in there. Some advanced development tools, DOM inspectors, resource monitors. These are more for uh, developers that are familiar with these kinds of resources. If you're not, uh, you probably don't need to worry about them too much. And finally, it's going. we also have a, a community resource that you can look at and see different kinds of uh, sites that others have done uh, that may actually be able to help you maybe in your own design. So you see some of these start loading up and you can see some of the cool things that others have created uh, using Mobi One and other programs uh, to be able to really get your options on how rich you can really make these applications for the iPhone. So those are going to be available to you there. And finally, let's say we've got this application just the way we want. We've tweaked the code. We've seen some other examples. Uh, we've got it just the way we want it to be, but we really want to see how this operates on our iPhone. So you can click this little envelope here, this little envelope icon, Send to My Phone. And it's going to be able to come up here. You're going to be able to uh, 
use the Mobi One AppSync email server, which is just a, a service that we provide free of charge for you to be able to test your applications. And you'll be able to email your uh, your device this actual design that you have. And what it'll do is it'll send you a text message with a link that you can uh, that you can open up, and it will actually run the application on your phone uh, off of the Mobi One server, so you can send it to yourself, your boss, or colleagues, and really see how that's working. Uh, you can look and see the exact format that you need based off of your carrier, and uh, email it to yourself right from here. And you'll just click finish, and that will go right to your own device, and you can test Mobi One from there. So that's a real high-level view of uh, Mobi One Studio, both the designer and the test center. And we have some other videos that'll go into more detail on all these features.